A major storm has drenched the northeast and slanted with fierce winds, knocking out power to hundreds of thousands. That's followed a bout of violent weather ranging from snowstorms to tornado reports in other areas of the country. Parts of Long Island and New York were inundated by coastal flooding on Wednesday. In New Jersey, roads were flooded and rivers were rising. The same weather system already brought heavy rain, hail, and at least three reported tornadoes to the south. Meanwhile, many areas of Florida faced the threat of flooding. And the snowy Midwest is being warned that temperatures could plunge, New Jersey Governor Phil Murphy declared a state of emergency ahead of the storm. Many streets and roads were flooded and rivers were rising after some areas got up to three inches of rain since Tuesday night. The rain fell on ground saturated by another storm a few weeks ago. Another storm is forecast for the weekend.gov. Murphy said 56,000 homes were without power and several hundred accidents and highway assists were reported, but no storm deaths. He said people often ignore flood warnings, to their peril. We finished all the work from the last flood in December. Tenants are back. Now we got to go through the same thing again. It's like, you know, crazy twilight zone. It's real terrible, it's real bad. It's like the second time within the past month and a half. It's not just easy just to up and move the way our times is right now with inflation and everything. So you gotta wait till you can move to get out of this situation.